The all-new ExactVision mobile app is available for Apple and Android devices. Install easily from the Apple App Store or Google Play. When first opening the app, you will be greeted with some data privacy information. Press the back arrow at the top to continue. Tap the Get Started button to begin. As a first-time user, you will be automatically guided to connect to your first ExactVision server. Your ExactVision system administrator should direct you as to which method you'll use to connect. The simplest method of adding a system to the app takes advantage of Exact's remote connectivity service. Obtain a single-use access code generated by your ExactVision administrator. Enter the access code along with your ExactVision user credentials before pressing the Connect Server button to add the system to your app and establish the connection. System administrators can also watch our separate video discussing the remote connectivity feature. Alternatively, if opting to use open network ports or connecting within the same LAN, users can choose to enter the IP address or hostname of the ExactVision server by selecting Enter a URL instead. Obtain the hostname or server IP address from your administrator. Both options require entering login credentials. After adding your first system, the live screen appears and will display the quick view if no views have been configured on your server. ExactVision Mobile emphasizes views rather than individual camera panels, making navigating scenes of interest easier. Quick View provides an ad hoc view each app user can personalize without affecting other users or making changes on the ExactVision server. Views are covered more comprehensively in our video on live viewing. Add additional ExactVision servers to the app by selecting More from the menu below. Then tap Settings and choose Servers to display a list of systems already added. Select the plus symbol above to repeat the steps of adding more servers. Users can manage their connections without removing them from the app by using the toggle control beside each added system to disable and enable those in their server list. While disabled, users will not be able to view live video, search for video, or receive events from the disabled system. Remove systems no longer needed by selecting the server from the server's list and choosing the Remove Server button at the bottom of the connection details screen. Continue to our other videos on using the ExactVision mobile app for further details on navigation, video search, and more.